again, this is Antonio, and I'm coming at you with another exciting video. In this video, first of all, I would like to start off by saying this is not financial advice. This is for education and entertainment purposes only. So let's get right on into this video. Uh, the model on this channel is I see the news and I report the news. So let's talk about some significant news here. Bitcoin exchange Binance banned from UK as crypto frauds double. And let's dive into this video. It's not going to be a long drawn out video. It's just a video that I think that's necessary uh, to basically explain. As you already know, cryptocurrency has been going through a lot as of late with China uh, basically trying to ban Bitcoin out of uh, China altogether. And with Tesla making moves as far as banning Bit uh, Bitcoin because of all of the resources that is take that it takes to mine bitcoin it just seemed like bitcoin um can't get out his own way because everything that it uh, uh aspect that it needs to prop itself up is going through the process of basically uh going through a process of humpty dumpty uh can anybody uh, put all the pieces back again well let's just talk about it the city watchdog has banned one of the world largest Bitcoin exchanges from operating in Britain among amid, amid mountain fears over the rise of cryptocurrency crime. And I did a video before talking about all of the Bitcoin scams or the cryptocurrency scams and people are uh, being scammed out of their money because they don't know a lot about cryptocurrency this thing is taking place and uh in the video i talked about uh the crimes was up a thousand percent as far as crypto crime so uh the financial conduct authority ordered binance markets limited to remove all advertising and financial uh, promotions by wednesday and told the firm it must not carry out any regulated activities in britain without prior consent the FCA actions comes just two days after the Japanese financial regulator issued a consumer warning against Binance. U.S. and German regulators has also raised a concerns over the firm's activities. The move is part of a broader crackdown on unregulated uh, crypto activity in the U.K. In January, the FCA became the anti-Monday money laundering and counter-terrorist finance and supervisor for cryptocurrency firms since the beginning of the year crypto related businesses have been required to register with the watchdog uh, before doing business in in the uk though most firms have granted temporary registration until july the watchdog's Mark Stewart said last week that 111 high-risk, volatile, unregulated crypto firms were still operating in Britain, posing a, a very real risk to consumers. The FCA said the Binance withdraw its application to become a regulated entity last month following the in, uh, intensive engagement with the watchdog. It said that the cryptocurrency firms had assessed to date over 90 PC had withdrew their applications. The, spokes, the spokesman for the SEA said the significantly high number of crypto asset businesses are not meeting the required standards under the Monday laundering regulations, which has resulted in an unprecedented number of businesses withdrawing the applications. The actions to taken today on the Binance Markets Limited has been in, in train for some time. From Wednesday, the firm will have to display a prominent message on its website and mobile app warning consumers that it is not permitted to undertake regulated activity in the UK. The FCA is also ordered that the firm secure and preserve all records relating to its British consumers in the original form to provide it to the to be provided to the watchdog on request binance is one of the largest cryptocurrency exchanges globally found it founded by chinese i mean canadian chinese de development chain pen zayo 
The firm launched Binance Markets Limited last year as a platform for UK investors to buy and trade cryptocurrencies with pounds and euros. The FCA issued a warning to consumers that no other entity of the Caymans Island-based Binance Group holds any form of authorization, uh, registration, or license to conduct regulated activity in Britain. Last month, the company came under investigation from the U.S. Justice Department and Internal Revenue Services part of the probe into money laundering and tax offices, uh, according to Bloomberg. In April, the German financial watchdog warned that the firm that it could be uh, fined for offering securities tracking digital tokens without publishing an investor uh, pr uh, prospectus. Binance cannot be reached for com uh, comment. The watchdog's action echoes a broader move in the financial services sector against unregulated cryptocurrencies firms. In May, banks, including Barclays, Monzo and Starlin block consumers from transferring money to platforms including Binance and Swissborg citing high levels of suspected financial crime with such payment. The number of cryptocurrency investment frauds reported to authorities doubled last year as the price of Bitcoin skyrocketed. Action fraud, the national reporting century for cybercrime received 7,014 complaints in the year to March 2021, compared to 3,608 in the previous 12 months, the law firm Penzet Mason said. The fraudulent schemes range from criminals impersonating regular cryptocurrency advocates such as Elon Musk. Rug pool schemes were seemingly legit, uh, legitimate cryptocurrency companies disappear with consumers' money and pump and dump schemes where fraudsters drive up the price of worth, worthless assets before selling out. A separate action fraud report published in April estimated that 113 million pounds was lost to cryptocurrency fraud in 2020. So basically, I myself have been frauded in cryptocurrency. There are tons of people they are using cryptocurrency because it's, it's still relatively new and they are using the process of scamming people out of money because they give you this as, uh, aspect of these get rich quick. Um, and in that video that I did before, I will say it again. Don't fall for it. Cryptocurrency scams are up a thousand percent. And if you don't put yourself in the, the aspect of knowing how to win, it's going to put you in the aspect of knowing how to lose because you're going to lose your money. And once you transfer money off of your wallet, it's gone forever. Uh, there are tons of money that has gone to uh, the wrong wallets or if have gone to people that are scams. And you just got to be really, really careful. I, uh, people are going to monitor what's going on with Binance because uh, relatively it is Binance's fault. But there are scams that set up that people are using Binance. That's why when you use platforms like Coinbase, you have to go through a long process to get your money off of Coinbase, even though it's your money. So without further ado, I just want to make this video about uh, what's going on with Binance is why it's banned from the UK. If Binance don't get itself together, it's going to be. Um, it's going to be in a world of trouble, which it probably ever is, and they're going to have to fix whatever's going on. So without further ado, this is Antonio with Team Tigio. Please like, comment, and subscribe as I'll be coming to you with more videos just like you, like this one soon, and I will see you next time.